Construction is in full swing on a 1,500-acre compound just outside Kabul city. The Afghan National Army will soon have its own premier military academy to train its next generation of leaders. All these barracks are going to get full. Colonel Michael Price, commander of the Transatlantic Afghanistan District in Kabul, sees tradition being built from the ground up. Every professional army in the world starts with a great education, and this campus will provide that. They're consolidating all the schools in Afghanistan for their senior non-commissioned officers and their officers at this location. The Afghan National Defense University will have the capacity to train up to 3,000 officers and senior enlisted, making it the marquee installation for an army on the rise. The compound is broken down into three separate phases. Uh, phase one is the, their version of West Point. Uh, phase two is uh, a bunch of specialty schools, uh, language school, counterterrorism, and the barracks to support that. And phase three is where we're standing right now, is their version of Sandhurst, where they will train all their non-commissioned officers. With the Army Corps of Engineers taking an advisory role, two Afghan construction companies are leading the charge in the building process. It's Afghan workers for an Afghan company building a facility for the Afghan army. With a scheduled completion date of September 1st, these dark hallways will soon be filled with soldiers ready to change Afghanistan's future. Reporting from Kabul City, I'm Army Staff Sergeant Daniel Sullivan.